What's going on guys? Today we're going to be taking a trip to the Tallgrass Prairie National Preserve. I've got my buddy Kyle here with me today and he's joining us from the great state of Nebraska and we're going to get some Kansas fishing in. So this will be a lot of fun. We're going to go pick up some food and tackle and drive out to the Tallgrass Prairie. We gonna give Mr. Twister a shot then. Let's just go with these black and blue. Do you mind? <laughs> All right, we just got out of Blue Stem, which is a little place here in town where basically anything you need, they got it. They got fishing, hunting stuff. Anyways. We picked up a couple lures, some water bottles, and we're gonna hit the road and go catch some fish. Okay, we made it, and it's really windy, and there's a lot of car noise. I hope you can hear me, but we're at the Tallgrass Prairie National Preserve, and we're gonna go catch my lens cap. Just about killed that car. We're gonna go catch fish and try not to get blown to Nebraska. Okay, we are at a pond and we're gonna fish it. It is so windy, my camera got knocked over, which, I mean, it got a little dirty, but that's about it. But we're gonna try throwing a worm and a jig and see what we can get. Hopefully the wind isn't too bad.
matter of finding a pond with dumb fish in it. This is why I figured it would be like fishing out here. <laughs> So in this video you saw me fishing out at the Tallgrass Prairie. Um, I'm going through the edits right now and I realized I didn't film an outro. I was too busy I guess and tired and we hiked probably about six miles during the filming of that video because we went up and saw some bison after fishing at first pond and then came down. Uh, I didn't film as much because I th thought it was too windy but looking back now I probably could have with this microphone that I've got that cuts the wind pretty good. But I was fishing today or yesterday with this little black and blue jig it's a flipping jig that i got at walmart for like a buck and then i was using these uh bass pro river bug trailers with the green pumpkin blue flakes uh, and it, it did the job pretty good but i feel like that pond that we were catching all those fish in that's one of those ponds where you could basically catch a fish with a rock uh, just because that pond is so overstocked and nobody fishes it and there's probably not very many fish like bait fish in there for the bass to eat so they're all pretty much the same size and they'll eat anything that they've seen move but all in all it was a really fun day it was a great experience I would love to go out there again uh, there's tons of ponds out there that I, I want to fish but there's a lot of them that are really hard to get to and you're walking through grass that's as tall as yourself 
and it gets very tiring. But I hope you guys enjoy this video. Give, leave me a thumbs up. Let me know that you liked it. If you haven't subscribed already, go ahead and hit that subscribe button. It means a lot to me. And so hopefully at the end of this week, we will be doing some duck hunting. So stay tuned for that. This might be the last fishing video for a long time. So enjoy this one. And that is all I've got for you. So I hope you enjoyed this video and I'll catch you on the next one.